My name is Charles Wright. I have driven over a million miles. My name is Clinton Ray Lindig, and I have been driving with here at Hirschbach since 2015. I'm Christine Gordy. I've been driving, oh, what, almost 25 years and close to six million safe miles. I'm Todd. I've been driving, had my CDL for 31 years. I've been really looking forward to getting some, some true truck drivers in this space that are outside this organization to, to give us some new feedback. And so um, I couldn't wait for today. Yeah. We're not talking ourselves from a tech perspective. We're talking more from the actual industry perspective. We do firmly believe that our software is safe and, it, and our operations are safe. And um, we hope to be able to replicate a million milers yeah. like y'all, like people who can who make it happen every single day. I didn't really have any preconceptions about the autonomous truck industry. Um, people think that it's here to replace the drivers. It, 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 it's really not. And we're still going to need people to inspect the trailers and inspect the truck. Any skepticism with autonomous trucks? <laughs> so I've seen Terminator. So you're starting a technology of you know autonomous driving. Where could that possibly not go wrong? With the future being that there's going to be nobody in there just blows my mind. Ready when you are. Ready, 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 ready to roll. All right. Welcome to the Aurora driver. Woody, when operates the turn signals? Yes, ma'am. Can you teach other drivers to do that? You know. <laughs> I like that. I do the exact same thing. It's pretty accurate. It can tell the size of the vehicle. Like you said, it participates a lot of things. I'm seeing what the truck is seeing. It is just insane. Like human eye, humans can't see this far. We can't see this many angles all at once. It's got better visibility than than we do as humans. It's, it's turns were so on point. Like I, I was looking over in in the. Uh, Driver's side mirror as it was doing its turns, perfect turns. I mean, took, used up the entire lane, kept it as wide as you possibly could. I was impressed by that because not a lot of drivers do that. It avoided a piece of wood in the road. Um, there was a car that was broke down on the side of the road, so it moved over. It slowed down and then moved over. Um, but it was really cool to, and it did everything. Stop signs, turn signals, the whole nine yards. And I was like, I wish they'd teach other drivers to do that. We're, we're talking cutting edge. I mean, the very edge of the cutting edge here is what you guys are working with. I have no problem. I, mean, I feel more safe with this on the road than I do from you driving. I think this is going to be huge. I, and and, and, and safety-wise, it's going to be a lot better. I, I hate to say that. But we, we're, we're human. We are fallible. I wouldn't mind getting behind one and just following it at a distance because I know it's gonna pick the safe route. You know, so I get behind it, set my adaptive cruise, and... Yeah, like I said, this way here is not gonna hurt nobody. It's not. And if you open-minded and not closed-minded, you're gonna get the big picture and like, good truck drivers are really hard to find. It really are, cause some people, you have to have the will and the determination to do what we do. We need all the help we can get out here. And as long as it's still doing what it's doing and it's not turning to the Terminator or, or my bad, transform into Ultimate Prime, we're gonna be all right. It was actually quite enjoyable and I'm excited to watch how this progresses. I mean, I'm not gonna be afraid of them. You know, I never was, but I, I definitely feel a lot safer around these now.